Hello everybody, Bonnie 22 here with my reaction slash review of Black Lagoon, episode 1. Now, as some of you know, if you've actually seen the announcement video, um, this is going to be a Patreon exclusive thing, don't know why, but I decided that I would upload the first episode on YouTube, of course, so that's what you're seeing now. So yeah. Um, so that's all I wanted to mention about that, so let's... Just talk a little bit about the episode and what I thought of it overall. Um, overall, I actually did enjoy the show. I think it's actually my first anime that I'm reacting to. I may be wrong about that, but I think it is my first anime reaction. And it's definitely different. I have seen anime in the past. Like, I've seen a few episodes of the original Dragon Ball show. I've seen, believe it or not, I've actually seen some episodes of Digimon. And I've watched a lot of Pokemon back in the day. So, yeah. But this is actually just going to be my first reaction to some to anime. But, um, Black Lagoon is definitely not what I was expecting. Um, like... You know, the the first main plot about this is some pirates, like, kidnap some guy who's working at this big office building who has a very important CD that has some pretty bad information on it. Like, really bad information on it that, you know, if the information ever got out in the public, the company would basically be ruined. However, the thing that I was definitely not expecting was all the guns in the show. That was definitely something different. Now, I knew there might be some guns in the show, but never, that, like, it was extreme. Like, holy crap, there was a big shootout in a bar. Like, holy crap. Like, literally guns everywhere, people getting shot everywhere. Man, it's just crazy. Like, holy crap. This actually might be a bit shorter of a reaction test review. Because, you know, a lot of interesting things. Like, there's a, like, that one guy that got, gets kidnapped by the pirates. He kind of has a little bit of a heart-to-heart -heart with the, the leader, I guess. And the leader basically understands, you know? So it would be kind of interesting interesting to see some more character development from him and, like, all the other people on this pirate crew. I don't know if I should say pirate crew. On this crew, I guess. Like, crew of bad guys, let's just say. And it'll actually be very interesting to see, like, how he, how the character evolves throughout the show. Because right now he's kind of, like, being scaredy and stuff like that. I, but I imagine that, like, as the show goes on, he might become more and more like them. You know? Like, more aggressive, more, I don't know. So it's actually going to be quite fun. To see that, if that actually happens. And I have hopes that will happen. It is a bit of a shorter show and it is ended. But still, I, I do, I do, like, really enjoy it. And I've actually already reacted to episode two as of recording this. Anyway. So yeah, like, okay, so at the end of the episode, the leader where the big guy in charge of the whole company where the CD was taken decides that disc cannot get out in the world, so he's gonna <laughs> he's gonna just send a helicopter force after them. And that's basically where the episode ended. Like it ended on a cliffhanger. I was like, what the heck? Why? Why? Um anyway, I did enjoy it. Definitely looking forward to reacting to some more episodes. Can't wait to see like what comes up next. And yeah, I guess you can all enjoy my reactions too.
Anyway, that will be pretty much it for this. Be sure to let me know what you all think of this reaction. And I'll see you on my next video. Bye.